Hello and good evening, Danny Alvarez. Can you hear me, boy? Hello, hello. Yes, I hear you. How's it going? Are you ready for the final day, huh? <laughs> yes, I think. <laughs> I think yes. Why? Why do you laugh? Why do you laugh? I can't believe it's the last day. It's so quick, huh? The... Yes. Do you have any expectation for next year in 2023, Daniel? What is mm. your biggest expectation for the new year? I, I have many problems with English. So my meta, my goal for mm -hmm. the next year is to uh, to speak more English to that's the idea. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, to improve your English, to speak better, to speak more fluent. Yes. <laughs> <clears throat> mm -hmm. And I already finished the and finished the the uni, university. Yet uh, the university studying. I have been studying system engineer. Yes, I'm in the middle of the career. I have two years with six months, <laughs> uh, five cycles. No, cycles? Five more, five cycles, yes. Five more cycles? <laughs> You're close? Middle. You're close? Mm -hmm. Time yes. flies by, Daniel, time flies by. Yeah. So uh, suddenly so you're gonna feel like, wow, my graduation is today. Wow, imagine that day. That day is gonna come. <laughs> Crap it. <laughs> come on. Come on. I don't know. And Angel. Angel. I don't know. I don't know what Angel has to say. He should say something about his biggest expectation for 2023. Oh, well, my biggest ex expectation for 23 in, is um, improve my English, at the first of all. Uh, well, so maybe uh, start to study, with a start to study or going to the university because, well, I already finished, but a uh, technician. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm a... Um, Contract quality technician, and now uh, so I want uh, to how do you say diploma teacher? A diplomate. Yes, I will. Uh, I want to study a diplomate about a uh, financial. Mm, financial. Yes, because yes, because uh, now. I'm a start, but just a course, a financial course, because my area in my work is like mm, to financial, mm -hmm. because I need to watch a lot of things about that. And for okay. the reason, I would like to 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 uh, study well, but I have a lot of goal to twenty twenty three, maybe buy a car. Because now uh, and also finish my house because I I just uh, I started to to building uh my house my own house but wow. I I couldn't finish because I have I had the accident but now I I hope in next year uh, finish my build my house and buy my own car. Finish building your own house, finish building your own house and buying your car, your vehicle. Yes. Well, at least you have one goal in common with Daniel. Daniel said that for next year, he needs to improve his English. He says, I want to get my English better. And, and that's one of the best goals you could choose for next year. The best way is, is uh, getting along with your classmates, having practice on a daily basis. Practice makes perfect. 
The more you practice, the better you get. As easy as that. I'm very glad to welcome everyone to this final class. Let me hear about your next, um, well, you actually, what is your biggest expectation for 2023, considering that this is our last day of class? What about um, Jose Mario? Hello, gentlemen. Okay, what about uh, Jaime Avelar? What is your biggest expectation for 2023, Jaime? Are you able to participate? Uh, hello, good evening, teacher and everyone. Uh, I am driving right now, but I very close to my home. <clears throat> oh, sorry, I am very close at home and I can participate. Perfect, perfect. Good deal, good deal. Try safe, Jaime. Uh, what about Lady Ventura, Mrs. Valdez? Welcome, Mrs. Valdez. How are you doing tonight? And what is your biggest expectation for 2023? Don't tell me you're driving as well, lady. Are you driving? Okay, what about Jacqueline Miranda? Are you there? Yes, I'm, I'm here. I'm glad to hear you tonight, Sorry, Jacqueline. Sorry, teacher. I'm busy. Oh, I got you. I got you, Ms. Ventura. No problem. I understand. Keep going. So, Jack, how's it going? What is your biggest expectation for 2023? Can we know? Yes. I, I have um, many goals, but one of the main goals that I, that I want to achieve is uh, get, getting my, my own car. And um, another, uh, getting a, a, a better position in my job because I need, I need more money to, to, to do many things. Uh, and another one is I want I want my own business and and I I think that is the best way to to get better in this in this country maybe it's very difficult but I think it's it better so I hope to 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 achieve it. Already, Miss Miranda. That sounds nice. You have big goals, big time, big expectations for 2023. And well, transportation is definitely a must nowadays. You don't have transportation. Um, it's difficult. Okay, and definitely you have now something in common with Angel. Angel has the same goal. Angel has the same exact goal than you, right? Buying his own car. And definitely it's a big challenge, but you can make it. And I hope you can make a good selection once you have the whole money and, 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 and be ready to, to buy it. Sorry. Yeah, right. Sorry, teacher, and don't forget to use an assurance with access fees. <laughs> That's a Magical great advice. advice. <laughs> I work Definitely. in access fees, sorry. <laughs> ah, you're making the commercial. It's a promotion, it's a promotion. <laughs> okay, well, hey guys, we're gonna cut that part. We're gonna cut that part, okay? We're gonna cut it. So I know when you buy your car, don't forget it. <laughs> commercials, commercials. Stop working, Daniel. Stop working. It's class time. Commissions, commissions. <laughs> What's going on, Julio Merino? What is your biggest expectation for next year, sir? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Uh, uh, it really is my my biggest expectation 
is now the, something material. I I price uh, uh, a good um, give me a, but very oh, God healthy for oh your health you want to be healthy for the next year yes and um, yes and um, it's difficult uh, to be healthy in these days is a very good health and uh, thank you uh a good okay uh, god 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 uh, give me a uh, good health in. good health yes uh, uh, yes um my my biggest expectation is um uh, continue continue in my work uh, for help my mom um uh, yeah um, my son my grandson um um i my face and no no uh, no deseo teacher <laughs> No pill. I, I I wouldn't like. I, I wouldn't like um I wouldn't like um something mat material um only only good health in um for try uh, in my life and uh, um, for health and the person of uh, I love you. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. So yes. pretty much you said that you are not a materialistic person, that you prefer to ask God for a good health. Yes, you teacher. Want to be I, healthy. In, in my in my life uh, learning um learning um uh, is is not good. Love it, love it. Love money is 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 a better lover person and and for you future is the person future um, future. future yes uh, the person um near 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 uh, near or my pers or my person you're uh, you're getting very yeah. romantic today Julio you're very romantic today. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> and, and my my life teacher um is it, it, me before rice uh, is uh, was very very hard. The rice learning um, me is is be, is better important person. Yes, uh, I learning um, a lot of person, help person. Yes, teacher. Um, is my history is wrong? Long history is no, no. It's not comfortable my my life. Um, always um, hard. My uh, I am a uh, war hard. Uh, always. Um, Yes, teacher. You are a very hardworking person. Thank you, Julio, for the heads up. And um, well, welcome everyone to our class tonight. Let me go ahead and go over the attendance real quick. Are you guys ready for the expositions? Just a little. More or less. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> what do you mean? So, Daniel, <laughs> for 2023, I will be ready, I think. <laughs> <laughs> You're a joker. <laughs> Daniel is, is over the star. Yeah, that's of course. We are ready. We, awesome. we born, born in. Yeah, ready. We were born. Oh we were God. born. Yes, we were born ready. Wow, that's the attitude. That's exactly what I'm expecting, you know, to see you guys shine, you know, like 
you are the teachers. This is the teacher's activity. One day is your turn to teach for everyone. So let me go over the attendance for today, Wednesday, the seventh, the final day of this module three guys in advance. Uh, I wanna tell you not to stop. I wanna tell you, keep moving forward. All of you have a big talent. It's been such a nice experience for me to, to cover teacher Jonathan with this class. Um, and I really enjoyed every class with you. I learned a lot from each of you. Um, and all of you have a big talent. I know that all of you can get to a point where you can be able to speak English very well and express your ideas freely, uh, comfortably, uh, with no hesitation and, and, and being more productive and therefore get more opportunities and, and scale to a different level and, and take your family to a different position and, and get to your place that, where you wanna be, you know? So keep studying. Keep studying because you have achieved a lot. I think you are in the middle of the road. You are in the middle of the road. Now, now the, 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 the benefit is coming, right? Because you go to intermediate four and then intermediate five, intermediate six, and then you're supposed to be to a, an advanced level. So keep enjoying guys this path, okay? So let me go Thank and call you. Lady Carolina Ventura de Valdez. Are you with us? She said yes, right? But she was busy. Angel Antonio Benitez Ventura, are you there? Yes, teacher. Present, Present teacher. Angela Estefania Marroquín Martinez. Carmen Eugenia Present, teacher. Reyes. Thank you, Angela. Present. Okay, Carmen, thank you. Okay. Daniel Arquimides Florentino Garcia. Present teacher. Daniel Ezequiel Álvarez Mejía. Present. Estela Mabel Orellana Andino. Jacqueline Yesenia Miranda Rodríguez. Present. Jaime Antonio Avelar Cortés. Present teacher. Jose Mario Valdez Gómez. José René Aguirre Chavarría. Present. José René Aguirre. I'm sorry. Um, let me see. Julio César Merino González. Present. Catherine Lisset Cáceres Montesino. <laughs> Kathy Denise Oriano Villacorta. Present. Soriano, great. Kenny Lisset Cuellar de Barrientos. Good evening, present. Good evening, Miss. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Good evening, present. Welcome, welcome, gentlemen. Um, Osvin Alexis Flores Hernandez. Present. Sabrina Lisset Garcia Orellana. Marielos Janet Cornejo Erazo. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Luis Alberto Galicia Gertrudis. Hello, I'm here. Welcome, Luigi. And Cristian Josué López Pérez. Very well, very well. So let me go back to where I can see all your faces. Carmen Treminio, can I know uh, what is your biggest expectation for 2023? Can you talk about it? Can you share a little bit? Yes, teacher. My big expectation for next year is finish my career and uh, have my own house. Wow, those are huge expectations, Carmen. ¿Cómo se dice? Tal vez no mi propia casa, sino más independizarme. 
Okay, uh, probably you would like to become more independent. Yeah, more independent. Absolutely, Carmen, that sounds very interesting. Getting your own house, all right, and finishing your career. What are What is your major? My career? Mm -hmm. I am a graphic design. Desi a graphic designer. designer. Yes. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah. Usually, um, women are very talented on that. Huh? Well, best of luck for you. Best of luck for you. What about uh, Osbin? Can you tell us, Osbin, what are your expectations for 2023 now that we are finalizing our class today, sir? Okay. Um... Uh, continue. I I will continue learning English. Learning, learning English and at English Corporativo, and, right? <laughs> yes, in, in English Corporativo. Talking about commercials like Daniela. <laughs> <laughs> yes, <laughs> um. I, I want to find other job, but it's difficult now because a lot of factories are, are closed. Um, it's necessary to uh, take care of the, the, the job. Yes. Because it's difficult to find, find other. Correct. Definitely. Keep practicing, Osmin. You can do it. You are a very talented uh, person. Uh, by my experience, I found that you have a lot of talent and you can be able to achieve to achieve the goal of becoming bilingual. 90% uh, of the language, you can easily get it. Uh, remember, practicing is the only way for you to achieve your goals. Practicing okay. all the time. Practice with your classmates. Practice with your teacher. Practice with whoever is possible. Anytime okay. you do that, that's a winning for you. That's a winning for you, Osmin. And okay, I know thanks. that for sure you will get a job, a better job with a big <laughs> salary. Okay. okay, thank you. All right. What about Kenny Quayer? How's it going, Ms. Quayer? What is your expectation? Expectations. What is your biggest expectation for 2023? Hello, good evening. Um, my, expect, my expectation for the New Year's um, is um, continue learning English. Um, um, I want uh, start um, maestria. A master degree. The master's degree in finan financiera, financials. Financials, wow. Um, yes. Um, during two years, but I, my expectation is to start in that 2023. Great. Congratulations on that new challenge you will take on that master degree. Few people can get to that level and, and, and you're trying to get there, Kenny. Congratulations. Keep it up. Keep it up. Thank you. Who else? Let me see. Manuel Antonio. What about you, Mr. Escamilla? What is your biggest expectation for next year, sir? Hello, good evening. Um... My bigger expectation the next year is I hope um, I hope to learn more English. I hope uh, speak English better. And the next year I 
I, I hope is they maintain conversation with the people who speak English. With American speakers. <laughs> yeah, That's the American. big test. <laughs> That's the big yeah. test when, when you have the opportunity to speak with an American speaker, a native speaker. Yeah, a native speaker. It's now, I, I think so. It's, I don't, I, I, I lost, I lost speak English. You lost track. I, yeah, I lost track. I'm I, sorry I, about that. But remember, you're still in the process. You're still a student. You're still studying English. So there are many things you still need to know, okay? There, there is many room um, to cover. So take it easy. Don't worry. Thank you. But I like the goal. I, I, very, I, I really like the goal you said. It's like, it's like Daniel's goal. It's like, uh, who else? Angel's goal. It was also, let me see, Osbin's goal, which is which is improve your English skills. It's it's fabulous. It's an amazing idea. You guys don't want to stop because if you stop, it's a waste of time. It's a waste of energy. So yeah, I I I I I, I think so. Is when I finish my career and at the university. It's I. It is the the first step. Um, when I when when I was my my first job, is I I was study English only only three levels. And in 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 this moment, is I I study my master degree. It's I not anymore uh, uh, study English and 20, 20 years more I I I I believe I think is okay it's now it's necessary to speak English I yeah. I need to study <laughs> definitely it's now a necessity right it's now a necessity studying English. Okay, let me hear Jaime. What about Jaime? Can, what can you tell us about your biggest expectation for next year? I can see you got home. You got home healthy and everything. Yes, I, I, I am at home right now. Um, <laughs> for the New Year's, first I try to, to survive to, to year 2022. <laughs> Survive. No, and, and and I don't think about this in this moment because um, in this time we are in the school we have a very very very, <clears throat> very work and so very much, much very much work, work. works. And maybe um, after the 16th, 16th, the December 16th, mm -hmm. I, I, I can think about this. But right, right now I can't. <laughs> All right. All right. It's too early. It's too early for you. Okay, yeah. I understand your idea. I understand your idea. Well, guys, uh, let's go ahead and start with the process of the satisfaction survey. Okay. Um, let's see, on the WhatsApp chat, I posted, see if I did. I think you have access to that video. Do you have access to that video? Okay, I'm gonna send it anyways. I'm gonna open the satisfaction survey so we can do it all together.
Okay, are you able to see my screen? Yes or no? No. No yet. Yes. Yes. Do you have access to this uh, survey? Yes, teacher. I'd be aware. Yes. Yeah. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, so we're going to complete the information all together, guys, so we don't make any mistakes. I have the information right here. Let me see. And I think you have it also on your emails, supposedly, right? So I'm putting the information on the WhatsApp and I'm putting the information also on this Zoom chat. Okay, so the first one, what is the first one? Let me see. Oh, that's the code, right? Ingrese el número completo de la orden de inicio. You see? I think I have it. Do you have this? 2A637-7810-005. Forward slash 2022. Yes. Great. Everybody. Okay, on number two, you gotta put your name complete, your full name as it is on your Dewey. Yeah, can you do that, please? In my case, I'm done. So... done? Yeah, teacher, hey. where, teacher, where I can find the this platform to make you mean the, the survey? I need a link. Okay, let me put it on the chat. Please, can you try? Thank can you, you. try? Can you try the one I just posted there on the on oh, the Zoom chat? Let me let me see. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. Thank you. Oh, okay, okay, okay. My pleasure. So, everybody done with the name? Okay, then we have yeah. to put the email address. Remember, it's the same email address you gave in the beginning. Don't get confused. It's the same email address you received the information to. Okay? Okay. And your cell phone Done. number. Done, all right. Your cell phone number. Oops. Your sex, female or, or male, okay? Department, CD, right, CD? You pick your CD up. Let's say I am from San Salvador. Uh, company you work for, the name of the company? the name of the company. Nombre del proveedor. Inglés corporativo.
acá. Inglés corporativo, regional international. That will be the one. Uh, are you with me? Are you guys with me? Yes. ¿Alguien yes. se ha quedado? Estamos todos ahí. Ok. Cool, cool, cool. Entonces, number nine, it says, ok, number ten, nombre del curso. ¿Cuál es el nombre del curso? Es inglés intermedio. Módulo tres. Tal cual. Inglés intermedio módulo 3. Bueno, ahí sí, abajo ya sería personal. Ok, ahí sí ustedes se evalúen ahí. Cualquiera, ¿verdad? According to your likes. Aquí la fecha de inicio. Sí. Um, octubre 31. 31 de octubre. Okay, Monday. And the finalization date is today. Today is the 7th, December the 7th. Ok. ¿Cuál es su nivel de satisfacción? Bueno, ahí tendría que ser... No se vayan a confundir ahí, ¿verdad? Porque um, a veces pueden equivocarse. So, choose the right one. Satisfaction. Ok. Ok, aquí este es optional. Mencione que otros cursos son de su interés. Si ustedes saben de algún otro curso. Como Excel, ¿verdad? Excel básico, intermedio, avanzado, tablas dinámicas. Eh, servicio al cliente. Etcétera. Next. Bueno, luego algún comentario que ustedes quieran hacer, alguna sugerencia. Okay, en el 16. Y luego pues le dan enviar. Una vez que lo envíen, chicos, deben, you have to take a screenshot, ok? You have to take a picture. You gotta take a picture. Que ya está enviado, ¿verdad? Después de darle enviar, you take a picture and you send it to the WhatsApp chat. Vamos a hacer ese proceso. Let's do that process right now, please. If you're so kind, I think I have somebody there. Let me see. Who's that, Denise? Who's Denise? Denise, Denise? I'm Denise. Denise, Kathy, Denise. Wow, that was very quick. Thank you so much, Miss Oriano. Get ready for your exposition. Thank you, Danny. I see you occurring now. I got your picture posted now on the chat. Thank you. Miranda, Miranda, Miranda. Somebody. Somebody's last name is Miranda. Thank you. Luis Galicia, got it. Thank you for putting your name. That makes it easier for us. Thank you, Angel, for putting your name at the bottom also. Thank you. Um, Jacqueline in the house, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sigan enviando ahí sus capturas. Ya con la encuesta finalizada. Ok, ok, ok. Alguien que haya tenido algún problema hasta ahorita. 
Cristian Josué. Thank you, Cristian. Yoda. Who's Yoda? Manuel. Manu, Manu, and his nicknames. Julio, ¿cómo vamos ahí, Julio? Right now is the survey, Julio. What are you doing? Yeah, sir. And, uh, me falta poco. <laughs> A little bit. Almost, almost. Yeah, almost, yeah, almost. Yeah. Kenny, Lisette. Good job. Thank you, Kenny. We appreciate it. We appreciate it. I think that's it, huh? Kenny was the last one. Who else? Who is still working? Who is still working? Only Julio is still working. Good evening. I have to repeat it. Give me a moment, please. All right. Absolutely. Means no problem. Take your time. Thank you, Rene. Hey, Rene, what is your big your biggest expectation for next year, sir? Hello. Mm, maybe I have two possibilities um, in parallel. In parallel. Con, um, say, say money for a one house and, and I will find the ma the one master and mind man project how old are you jose 30 30 okay that's a good age all right we hope all your dreams come through mr Neagirre. all right keep working for them okay yeah thanks okay i think yeah. we're done Let's see, Ospin, I have Ospin, Estefania sent a file. That's a different kind of file. Angela Marroquin, oh, Kiroki, Angela. Oh, I see, Angela. You got it? Me cayó ahí on file, yeah, ahí está. Okay. All right. Okay, I think we're done with this process, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much for completing the survey, the satisfaction survey. We appreciate it. And to us, it's been really a big pleasure to have you. Now is your turn. Now is your turn to shine. You're going to have your opportunity to present your expositions. And this is obviously evaluated. So I'll be taking notes in my end. I'm going to take notes of your team and I'm going to assign you a score. All right. So let's just start with, well, in order, right? Team number one. Hi. <laughs> so that's... Give me a moment, please. Oh, one oh, moment. Sure. Stella is part of the number one team. Okay, okay, okay. So, we're, are, do you need to wait? You need to wait for Stella. Yes. Please, teacher, I'm sorry. I, I I didn't finish the 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 survey. Satisfaction. Yes. Give me a moment, okay. please. Sure, sure. Take your time. What about team number two? Is team number two ready? Team number two? No yet, because the other classmate need to finish. The, oh, okay, so, they haven't yeah. finished the survey, okay. Let's give them five more minutes, okay? Five more minutes, because it shouldn't take that long. 
I'm sorry. It should not. Go ahead. I got disconnected because I had problem with my internet. Um, mm -hmm. I don't listen. What do you say about the survey? Oh, you need to complete the survey. Do you see the link? Um, the one that is in the chat. In the chat. Uh huh. Go to that link, please. Open it up. Okay. Yeah. Uh, give me a minute. Sure. Everyone has to do this process, guys. This is mandatory. Everyone must do it, please. It says, encuesta de satisfacción. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. okay, now the answers. With the information that you write in the chat. Yes. Okay. Let me know. Send me an image before you before you you accept it, okay? Because it's important not to make mistakes on this. Okay, I I need to when I write all the things. Yeah, be very careful with the numbers. If uh -huh. I were you, I will copy and paste if it's possible. Copy and yeah, paste yeah. it. Okay, I will do it like that. Thank you, Kathy. You are the best. <laughs> no, you are the best. Oh, don't tell me that. <laughs> don't tell me that. Tears are going to come. Tears are going to come. I get nostalgic. Every time I finish a module, I get nostalgic because I miss my students. I get very, like, attached to my students. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who else is still working on the survey? Did you finish, Julio? What are you eating, Julio? Yeah, did well, What are you eating? Sent the picture in WhatsApp. And what are you eating, sir? What are you eating? Are you eating? Hmm? Are you eating pupusas right now? What are you eating there? No, it is it, not. Mm, teacher. Platanito. What's up, Danny? Mabel is, is ready. Sakes. You, Mabel is ready? Awesome. People, let's start with the exposition. <laughs> Team number one. Here we go. This is your microphone. Go ahead. So, okay. Uh, Angel, Kenny, Stella, and I can't see you. Jacqueline. Ah, Jacqueline. I'm here. I'm so nervous. <laughs> uh, can you see the presentation? Not now. Oh, now yes. Okay. So, okay. <laughs> good evening, everyone. <laughs> wow, nice presentation. Very we fancy. We are. <laughs> I like fancy, fancy, fancy things. <laughs> uh. Good evening, everybody. We are team number one. Uh, the subject I we choose is how to use would rather. So, Angel, you can start. Okay. Good evening, everybody. Well, today we talk about a very easy topic, I think, um, because it's for how to use uh, would you rather. If you know, in Spanish, it's like uh, a preferiria or something like that. Is you, you for you understand more. Can you advance, advance, please, uh, Danny? Okay. Uh, today I will talk about um, how is the structure, uh, how to use. Uh, well, today uh, I will try to explain a lot in. I hope you understand me. Well, at the beginning, when say when we speak about specific preference, would rather and would prefer have the same meaning, and um, are inter interchangeable. Well, how to know? Uh, when you use a would rather, you use a would rather plus 
the verb is an infinity, you know? For example, would you rather can be abbreviated to would rather? It's like a, with the, you observe the D with apostrophe and rather is the, um, I don't know. I don't know, it's like a abbreviation teacher, abbreviation or the short. Oh, well. In, when you use a would rather, don't forget to put the verb in infinity, the first of all, and that you observe in that case. The, would you prefer is followed by two plus infinity or a noun? Isn't the first of all. And when you use a past tense after would rather, when we speak about the section of other people, even though, even though that action may be in the present or future. So you can use um, would rather in different time, in different tenses. For example, in the present, in the past, in the future. So in negative, in question, you can use a different, uh, in different uh, places, right? So you can use that. And so you can try to, to understand what is the, the position and to use the verb. For example, I told before that the verb after would rather is infinity. For example, I'd rather go to the cinema. If you observe well, you the verb go is in infinity. And so if the verb is in past, is the same, just the, the verb in past, but in infinity. I would rather went to the cinema, is the same. Or maybe is the same, like I said, I would prefer. So, if, for example, if you can observe in the presentation in the, the right part, there are some examples about uh, to use the would rather. Well, first of all, is I would rather you took, if you have a a subject, but after subject, the verb is in infinity. So uh, the same. Uh, mm -mm. Uh, well, do you know uh, when you use a would rather, you try to to talk with uh, something you prefer. Uh, for example, I would rather to to win something or win the the, the soccer may some countries sometimes uh, you can maybe I don't know uh, Argentina or another country so but is is easier to use it now because uh, would rather it's like a express a preference and you need to you you, you just need to to observe the structure, that is would plus infinity, the verb in infinity, infinity, sorry. Would rather and after the verb, and, but the verb is in infinity. That in the example, I would rather go to the cinema. Yes, you got it? Yes, sir. Yes, okay. Okay, so the next uh, screen is uh, we can see the examples uh, we, with the question form, the affirmative form and the negative form. So Mabel, could you help, help us with this Good screen? Good evening. Um, uh, we can use, would you rather? Um, when you uh, have to take a, a decision and use the question form. Uh, it's when you uh, use will blast subject, blast rather, blast verb in the uh, basic form and the complement. The complement can be uh, nouns. Then 
um, we have an example here. Uh, would you rather be a girl or a boy? Would you rather eat ice cream or peanut butter? Uh, you can use that for uh, express do you prefer? And you express in your answer what you decide uh, in this uh, in these op options. Would you rather have a dog or a cat? Would you rather speak English or Spanish? Would you rather use Nintendo or Wii? And then we are going to uh, how to express the, the answer. Uh, the subject, blast. Would rather blast the verb in infinitive form too. And the option that you decide. For example, uh, would you rather use Nintendo or we? I would rather use Nintendo. This is the answer. This is the way if you can use for um, these examples. Then can you change the, thank you. This example is for Jacqueline. It's okay. okay. It's for you. And the next one is, is for Jacqueline. Ah, okay. This is the answer. <laughs> is the yes. what do you what do you answer uh, uh, for this question? Uh, subject blast will rather blast verb and complement. Uh, the example is: Will you rather watch movies or ser series? I will rather watch series. This is the way. If I, I ask you, would you rather be a, a victim or, um, how do you say that? I don't remember. Um, Maybe um, victim is. <laughs> okay, if someone uh, can give me any example about that, I would like to uh, hear your your example. Maybe uh, would you rather play basketball or play football? How you answer that question, Noel? I would rather uh, play football. Okay, <laughs> thank you. So <laughs> thank the you. next the next part is the negative form with Jacqueline. Okay, hi everyone. I'm going to talk about negative form of would rather. We already know how to use would rather in affirmative form and for questions. Now I will explain how we can use negative form. And only you have to, to add uh, the word not after would rather. For example, I'd rather not have meetings in the morning. Or another example, example it can be, I would rather not eat pizza at night because it can be dangerous for my stomach. And you can use uh, the complete form or you can use the contraction form. So it's very important to know the, the, the grammar for this, for this topic uh, because you can um, speak, you can speak very better, better. Okay, uh, the next uh, screen is a conversation. Hey, Kenny, can you help me with the conversation? Uh, the, in the, this conversation, we use uh, would rather. 
Okay. Thank you there. <clears throat> Hola. Hello. Hello, Kenny. Oh, I hear you. Sorry. My microphone. Okay. Yes. So uh, the conversation starts. Uh, good afternoon. Can I talk with Kenny? Yes, I am Kenny. I call you from Avianca, and I'm glad to have an interview with you. Thanks for calling me. I interest. Uh, Kenny, would you rather have the interview in English or in Spanish? I'd rather have it in English, please. Okay. Uh, would you rather work in the morning shift? Yes, I would. I'd rather not work until late because I have a child. I see. Let's talk about your experience. Yeah, sure. Thank you, Kenny. <laughs> so that's an example uh, for a conversation. And for the end of the presentation, we have a, a game. <laughs> so we need uh, one volunteer or I choose one person from the class. Come on, guys, be <laughs> volunteer, please. Daniela <laughs> Kimia. Or Jose René, I don't know. Volunteer for what? Sorry. Um, uh, it's, it's a game. To... It's for one million dollars, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> the okay. idea is to stop the, the circle and it's a question with for would me. rather, okay. yes. Uh, okay, I stop. Uh, would you rather have meetings in the morning? Yes, I would rather have a meeting in the morning because for me, I, my mind is fresh. Uh, I, my, my head is clear, I think. All is possible at the morning. Okay. I think. Don't <laughs> I don't know. You, <laughs> you use, you use uh, the word rather very well. <laughs> Thank you, Dan Daniel. You're welcome. Another volunteer. Victims. <laughs> oh, victims. <laughs> I don't know. Sabrina is not here. Kathy oh. Montesino. <laughs> That's a good big team. Kathy? <laughs> Kathy Montesino. Yeah. If she's around. I should. I don't know. I, I can't see the teacher. The... <laughs> I can't see the person in the in the Zoom. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Okay, Manuel. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you start. Yeah. Uh, you. <laughs> uh, no. No. I have problems with the. <laughs> the rotate, but the questions okay. Say... So you choose the questions for the people there, huh? <laughs> hey, what happened? <laughs> this is fraud. Would okay, you, please have the would you rather, <laughs> I want, I want, okay, would you rather read minds or be invisible? Mm, yes, I would rather the invisible because, um, I, I. I like I I would like to to hear the different situations um, with affects with, with affects the my my job. Okay, thank you. <laughs> you would prefer invisible, be invisible. <laughs> be invisible. <laughs> sounds good. Sounds good. <laughs> The question is from the video of that class. So it's so fun. The class is so funny. 
For example, would you rather be handsome as Captain Captain America or be rich as Iron Man? <laughs> eh, Who's that for? Uh, Jose René. Oh. I I would rather Iron Man. <laughs> okay. I would rather be. I would right, rather right, be. Right, I, right, I would rather. I, I would rather. <laughs> it, is okay. it is easy answer. <laughs> Can you remember that class? I think it's yes. It was nice. And the last one uh, for Jaime. <laughs> Would you rather to be a super villain or be a superhero? I would rather to be a super villain. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? 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 Um, because the um wait I the superheroes may um sometimes um how do you say the defending defend um superheroes sometimes defend the um, the criminals <laughs> the criminals <laughs> okay with the como se dice the traje o cuello blanco no no Traje blanco, like white suits. Like white suits. Like white suits. Maybe. And the super villain, um, they have um uh, uh, how do you say un pasado incomprendido? Misunderstood. Sorry? Misunderstood. Um, misunderstood. Um, mm -hmm. A misunderstood pass. <laughs> and and they um and they try to defend your ideals in mind ideals uh -huh. ideals okay interesting <laughs> thank you for the attention and that's our exposition wow we give, uh, give it up give it up for these people congratulations thing number one very creative and very interactive you made a lot of your classmates think and you made a lot of your classmates participate now remember you say uh, i would rather and you don't use a preposition right you use a verb in the infinitive form in the normal form okay so be careful with that. Let's go with team number two. Team number two. Are you ready, team number two? We were born and ready. Ah, hi, hi. <laughs> Let's go make it happen. I'm Here ready, you go, I guys. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let me... Give me a moment, please. Okay. I give you two moments. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me see. I will share the screen. You can see it? Yes. Okay. Okay. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, classmate. This time we will present to you a Chaparro's liquor. It's made in, or oh, how it's made? It. I hope it you like it. Okay. In this case, uh, uh, our dear classmate Manuel will explain uh, 
how to make it. He will explain step by step how to make it the Chaparro beverage. It's a natural product, it's a natural product. It is very acceptable for, for, for a lot of people. Uh, so in this case, please, uh, Manuel, explain step by step how to make a uh, uh, Chaparro's beverage. Okay, good evening, everyone. Um, the Chaparro's is a traditional drink uh, from El Salvador. Is the native people uh, drink uh, drink uh, chaparros when when they, when the native people have a celebration for for the parties for the birth or for or, or when the community have a a a wombs, a a a sport and the uh, the chaparros is is a, a a good a good beverage and um, when when the people uh, make a chaparros liquor is the first step is uh, make make a fresh if the different fruit is put a uh, corn um, or maybe um, rice or or maizillos um, different fruit, for example, tamarindo, uh, mangoes, um, marañón, or other 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 fruit is uh, um, and and also and also is cinnamon and cane sugar and, and, and cinnamon cane sugar. Or, 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 or maybe honey is 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 not enough. Is different. Is is not enough. Is the ingredient. It's put the different mixes and have a a a, a fresh um, for condens. It's about a uh, fifteen days. It's the second step is condense if the the chichas. Chichas is not is, is not equal chaparro. Chaparro is is the condense is the condense for for the for the for the the, the first uh, beverage is is a uh, 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 chichas is is not enough is the it's not enough. Uh, the, the ingredient is to put more. Where, whatever ingredient do we would you like? Thank you. Okay, it's, it's correct that your information is correct because uh, I have an investigation about the how to make it chaparro. In this case, we we decided to do a uh, three flavor. That's correct, Manuel. What is the three flavor we will to do? Okay, and um, the people in El Salvador if uh, they prefer is the the different flavor. If the flavor prefer is when chaparro when chaparro is Chaparros curados is the for the uh, is the fruit is uh, the people prefer is number one is tamarindos number two is mangoes in number three is is a mixed uh, is a mixed fruit is tamarindo more mangoes. Okay, yes, uh, uh, our products. It has enough uh, enough attractive to buy. For example, we have uh, this information, extra information. The Chaparro reaches forty percent alcohol and can serve as a base to prepare drinks such as Cuban mojito. Chaparro is one by set on highest width and score of the latest is percentage of alcohol reaches reaches. There to buy and 
70 degrees. Uh, the chaparro is delicious if he is a uh, very good prepared. When, okay. when the people visit, when the people visit El Salvador, the foreigner is, um, the, the people say is chaparro uh, saying to sake in Japan and, um, and what in is whiskey. the answer to that? In, in whiskey, in whiskey is England. What happened? But, what is what is the me? answer that they are similar? If they are similar, is the sake in Japan and whiskey in England. Okay. Uh, vodka in in where in Russia. Vodka in Russia, yeah, it's Wrong similar, in Nicaragua. Uh, great alcohol. It's a tequila, delicious. It's, it's a tequila in Mexico. Like a Mexican, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Chaparro is the national beverage of El Salvador. I, okay. I recommend it to I recommend it to to celebration this next the next uh, the next the next holiday and and the Christmas you 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 will you will drink a Chaparros. Who would be very yes. happy with that, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm very, very happy. <laughs> Okay. Thank you for the recommendation, guys. <laughs> yes, uh, our dear Austin explain was how the the people prefer the this beverage. Ah, okay. Um. Yes. Um. First, I didn't want to try. Chaparro because some people told me that this was made by, by ham. And it's fermented in, for me, fermented drinks are not very hygienic, but um, one time you try it, uh, you, you, don't, you don't want left, uh, only, only one Chaparro. Because chaparro have uh, is made with a different flowers and can be tamarindo, piña, or rosa de Jamaica. It's a it's a good flower. Chaparro have a uh, is a delicious drink for for the party and in the holidays and it's an excellent drink uh, but it's necessary you drink by uh, you drink by responsibility it's not about drink to be uh, drunk but about spending on uh, Pleasure moment with your friends and family. And okay. Okay. Uh, and yes, you, you should be responsibility enough with the Chaparro. Excellent information. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Osby. Uh, our classmates, uh, Julius, will explain how to sell chaparro in El Salvador. He explained the strategies. Uh, Julius, please do it. Es explain us. Well, 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 Daniel. Uh, or or clients, uh, I was value that they receive and they deliver. That is why our company will make an effort with the short product and since why well now that all consumer expect good experience we will offer them three flower with an out a distribution channel such as restaurant supermarket and convenience stores positioning or 
and make it in attractive and of in price promotion and advertence advertising through radio, television, and social network. Um, uh, and all, um, uh, finally, you know, is um, bad uh, means to, to necessary degree. And not follow the object it is modified. Uh, it can be used for the positive and negative sentence. Um, yes. All. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Julius Cesar. Uh, yeah. Uh, let me see. Uh, Stefania, please ask the question to us, Bing, uh, for finish these topics, please. Stefania, are you here? No, I think it's not. Okay, I will ask you. Okay, I... I will ask you. Okay, Aspin, have you heard about the Chaparro before? Have you heard about the Chaparro? Aspin? Daniel. No. Daniel. Okay. Ah, okay, okay. Hey, este. <laughs> so, Daniel. Yes, I, I heard about the Chaparro. It's an excellent beverage in El Salvador. Okay. Uh, okay. Like you, Have you ever like, drunk Chaparro? Yes. Um, yes, but it's necessary you have responsibility because it's additive um, drink. Okay. Daniel. Okay. Uh, yes. Um, you can describe brand uh, Chaparro using adhesive enough? Uh, ask me the question again, please. Uh, can you, uh, you can um, describe, describe, describe uh, yes. the brands the brands uh, Chaparro using it is using enough. Using enough. Yeah, describe, describe, describe it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Can you? You can? Uh, I don't really know because I need more information about that. Uh, but I will, I will have an investigation about that. After that, I will explain. Okay, we, we, we finish this presentation. Thank you for be patient. Thank you and really appreciate your time. Our topic is analyze a national products and price. For it, we always explain about that. Thank you, everyone. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That's all. <laughs>
Boom. <laughs> what, what is, where is the option? Well, it's on the middle, next to chat. It should say share screen. Yes, I mean, in my case, the option is new share, but, but we have an option to the, the share. I don't know. Let me in see. the button yeah, red, you can stop. You can stop. Uh, stop, ah, stop share. share. Yes, thank you, yes. thank you. Yes, the button, the red button. Yes, thank you, Mr. Jaime. You're welcome. I mean, it's great with Zoom. Okay, team number three. Team number three, are you ready? Okay, I'll be ready. And the team, the Kathy, Jose, Lady. Yes, ready. It's Mario. Okay. Um, I will share with you the screen. I'm sorry. Okay, can you see the screen? Yep. Yes, 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 sir. Okay. <clears throat> hello, hello, good evening. Uh, today we are presenting the clarify expression. And um, for the start of this class, we, we have a conversation. And Lady Amy, um, we will read the, the conversation and, and then we need to volunteer for, for read this, uh, this conversation too. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just discovered this new brand as Dina Monzora is delicious. But when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simple put, this owner is the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching is a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of this brand and their images in a name. In other words, this can the cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. Okay, um, right now we we need to volunteer for read this conversation. Me. Me? Okay, Ezekiel and Angel, thank you. Okay. Okay, I will start. Okay. I just discovered this yeah. new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious. But when I visited their fan page, I saw they only had 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simple, but put, simple put. The owners of the brands aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for the product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you are right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes. Consumers are aware, aware of these brands and their image and names. In other words, this cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher sales and become more competitive. 
Okay, thank you so much for your participant. And um, can you see the the words is re result uh, in the in the conversation? Simple put. Simple and put. In other, in other words. In other words, yes. Okay, um, these words we know as clarified expression. Now we learn about the clarify the clarify expression with the and uh, Jose. Jose is um, the next participant, the next teacher. Wait, are you ready, Jose? Yeah. Okay. For the start this topic, uh, we need we have a, a question. But okay, guys. Okay, guys. A brief explanation of what are the clarify expression. When we use clarify expression, sometimes we need to introduce clarification, explanation, or exemplification of your ideas as we speak. Use in other words. That is to say simple put set to make your point clear to other we have some example the fear is you can increase your rating as an expert and reach a broader market by developing a podcast that is to say record your talk and allow your customer to download it the second today's customer are looking for warranties, sample pot, but exceptional service after they have purchased your product. Continue, Katie, Sorian. And we have examples. For example, the first example is you can increase your rating as an expert and reach a broader market by developing a, pro, a podcast. That is to say, record your talks and allow your customer to download it. And we have uh, three examples more. And the second is today's customer are looking for guarantees. Simple put, that is a clarified expression. Expressional service after they have purchased your product. And we have two more. Uh, who wants to read the third one? The third one. Volunteer or? Yes, volunteer. Okay, one, 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 <laughs> one volunteer for. Um, for read the, the third one. The third yes. one, yes. Okay. I'm going to do it. Examples? No, the read the, the third one. Uh, sometimes we need? A foreign. Yeah. For foreign. Foreign. Yeah. Foreigners. Uh, no, uh, paragraph number three, or sentence um, number three, Stella. Okay, thank you. Foreigners who come to El Salvador look for pupusas. In other words, they must go to Oloquilta to try them. Excellent. Do you know where is the clarify expression in that sentence, Stella? In other words? Yes, thank you. And another participant to the final sentence? I Who wants to read? Okay. Learning English is my goal for the year, which means that I have to study every day to achieve it. Excellent. And you know what is the clarify expression? Call or beating. Kathy, where is the, the clarify expression? Which means, yes. And we can use different clarify expressions to do, to make different sentences and different examples. You, uh, who wants to give me an example? 
for example, using another clarifier expression. Who wants to give me an example? Victims. <laughs> Victims. Kati, choose one. Um, I can help you if you want. Oh, okay. Okay. You need to make the accounting sit in sub with the salaries. I mean, you have to insert the amount of the salaries that the employee is receiving the payment and the low discount to and at the end the charge and payment need to be equal. Excellent. And next is Jose Mario. Jose Mario already. Jose Mario is here? Yeah. Okay, let's practice, Jose Mario. Okay, guys. Um, the practice is uh, clarify, clarify expression. Uh, read the number one. Let's go. I need your help, and let's go. Let's go together. We all know which phone brand has a fruit at this logo. What the uh, clarify expression use? You can uh, use this this clarify expression in this. Um... Yep. Uh, okay. Uh, in, in other words, we are talking about uh, Apple, no? and uh, let practice. Uh, the second sentence is, "I encourage bad rating in math." Um, simple book. I have to study a lot more. Okay. Um, another two volunteer or big team. What prefer? Maybe big team. Yes, maybe big teams. You can okay. choose one big teams. Okay. Um, tell me, Daniel Florentino. Daniel, Daniel. You are you there? See, Daniel. Or okay, next big thing is uh, Osbin. Help me with the clarified expression. Tell me one sentence. Um let me see. Yeah, the, the um, clarified expression is in other words, which means simple pop, namely, and that's it or to say. It's in, in other words. Okay, using in, in a sentence. Okay. Is necessary tell the truth. In other words, you show sincerity. Excellent. Thank you, Osmin. Yeah. <laughs> and and in all situations, the sincerity or it's necessary. Excellent. Uh, which one? Uh, another big team. Um, Uh, Jacqueline, Jacqueline Miranda. Nobody. Okay. Hi, man. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I am a teacher right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I need to uh, to volunteer for the the the, the make a sentence. Angel. Angel Antonio is the best student in the class. Yes. <laughs> How Let's about go, Angel? <laughs> is the, the student. We need to, to create a sentences. That's yes. correct. Yes. Yes, using uh, clarified expression. Okay. Well, let me think about it. <laughs> okay, go. You can do it. 
Okay. Uh, we need to to go. We need to go to the company tomorrow. Uh, in other words, I need to wake up very early. Excellent. Yeah, Every excellent. day. Yes. Yeah, Thank we... you, classmate. Thank okay. you for your attention. Okay, Teacher, right now. Uh, okay, thank you. Thank you, everyone. We have a, a solution of the, the first examples. Okay, thank you for your attention. And right now we have uh, Teacher Caleb. Yes, definitely. That was very interactive. I really like to leave you, to leave you, to let you go. And I like to see the way you guys help each other, how you guys try to connect your ideas and ask for help. And, and everyone is trying to contribute. And you know what I like the best is that we, you do it using the little English or, or the most English that you have. You're not depending on Spanish. That's the best of all. So I only have congratulations for all of you guys. Let me go with team number four. Do we have team number four? Or no? Yes, teacher, hello, yes. There you go, Luigi. You're the last team, correct? Yes. It's very short now. No problem. Last, <laughs> you are the last, but not least. Okay, you're not you're not least less important. Uh, you are as important as the other groups. So we're very happy to have you. I'll pass you your microphone now, sir. Yes. Okay. But we are not complete. Oh yeah. What's the problem? Okay. Who's absent? I think that's Sabri. I didn't see Sabrina and Christian. Sabrina and Christian. Oh, that's too messy. Yeah. Sabri, I remember she said she would connect at 9 p.m., but she never did. Yeah, yeah, and she don't respond the message in WhatsApp, so I don't know what happened. That's very strange. That is very strange. She's always very responsible. Yeah. So let's take let's take yeah. actions. Somebody's gotta cover those parts, guys. Okay. <laughs> Let's do our best. Well, <laughs> yes, no problem. Um, okay, uh, we're going to talk about the, the third piece of marketing uh, mix. Is, um, is um, um, the topic to, to practice in, in business. Business needs um, strategies is uh, business need um, design a good uh, product, design a good um, channel of distributors, and uh, we have the first piece of market mix, and the, the first one uh, P is product in marketing, product is an object or service made available for consumer. So in marketing a product um, is um, evaluated um, constantly and is um, the main um, uh, the, the main thing in, in the business. Uh, to to do the best product, uh, to distribute the, the best product in the best way that we um, have to uh, make a, a distribution. And uh, if you are um, uh, giving a service, you have to do uh, the best service what you can make make sorry. the product 
and the product um, is uh, very important, but why is the product marketing important? Uh, the product marketing in the business um, makes the companies um, to, to grow up, uh, increase sales, increase the market and and um, is very useful to let the product um, uh, cover more and more consumer every day. And uh, but after you have a solid product and you know customers for it are out there and the product marketing allows you to first learn about your competitors and you have to learn how is how is the product from your competitors and you have to look for advantages from um, that situation in the in the market the second one position the product in the market uh, taking advantages from the market and if you know what is your uh, main competitor is a um, good tool to um, to place your product in market market and take advantage advantage in in uh, the distribution and presentation and promotion about your product uh, the next one the third differentiate your product from others and you have to know um, what is the difference in your product and you have to um, increase that in market use and the other one use customer feedback to improve it or create new products is very important um, get different opinions from the market from your customers the client says that they uh, see in your product and the day what they feel with your product and and we have to know what is the best thing in our product to give the client to the client okay the price um is the amount that the consumer will will be willing to pay for a product marketers most like the price to the products real and perceived value we we'll also consider in supply cost see a sole discount competitors prices and retail markup can you change change the slides please marketers also need to determine when any discounting is appropriate a discount can draw in more customers but it can also give the impression that the product is less decidable than it was uh, we can see that the price is um it's very important because you need to um be able to consider the manufacturing the time that you expend and all the things Okay, place also means making sure that your product is available in the right quantity to ensure that you're able to satisfy the demand for, for your product. Uh, key questions to answer during this stage of the four P's of marketing is what is the the most appropriate distribution channel for your product or your service 
will you set directly to the customer? If not, how will you get your product to where you are selling it? Other questions to answer in this element include uh, what form of transportation will you use to get your product to where you are selling it and how will you manage inventories is called multi-channel distribution when you sell your product via more than one distribution channel in a few words plays it refers to how and where people will buy your products. And you, you want to make sure that your products are available when and where customers want your products to be available. And that's it. Thank you. Okay, the last B, promotion. What is promotion? Can you change the slides, please? Okay, what is promotion? Next. Luis, can you change the slides, please? Well, promotion referred to the entire set of activities which communicate the product, brand, or service to the user. The idea is to make people aware, attract, and in to induce to buy the product in the preference over others. The promotion is important because it's the strong way that the other people uh, know about the product that you are selling. The promotion of the product in these days are more easier because if you don't want to spend a lot of money, you only need to be like in social media that can do almost everything for you because in nowadays this is not the most popular method and we can see that are so many other ways to to promote uh, can you change please how to promote the service or product there are different ways on how to promote a product or service. For example, the social media that I mentioned, um, advertising, commercial, flyers, brochures, and new papers. Can you change, please? Okay. Um, as, as I say, these are um, the social media are some examples how you can promote your service. And if you look the images, they're like um, very common in the social media to see. We have brooches that nowadays they, they use, but not like, like uh, social media because you need to spend more money with this and like flyers too. Can you change please? Okay, and we can see the flyers. They're like I said, um, more expensive and you you have to give the, that to the people that are on the street and the newspaper. Nowadays, um, some some people don't um, read the newspaper, so it's a uh, old method. So thank you. Okay, we finished um, and we have two, two, two questions for, for you all. And what do you think the product has to have a good image? What 
product. Whatever product. Whatever. The one that you like the most can be. Mm. I think Maybe. the product think... has to. It's better if uh, if has a good price, but I don't. Know. Okay, good. Thank you for your opinion. Uh, the the product um, has to have a good price. Very good. And what about the image? I think it's important that the product have a, a good image because um, uh, sometimes we choose a product for the image and it doesn't matter the price. And it's not good. Yes. <laughs> What's that noise? I don't know. <laughs> okay. I was asking to say. This is noisy. Oh. I think that someone is. <laughs> is that part of the show or what? Yes. <laughs> Somebody's making fun of us. Manuel Escamilla has the microphone activated. Yeah, maybe that's. Camilla. Come on, Manu. Behave, man. <laughs> what happened? Your microphone, man. He didn't, your he didn't microphone. Notice. You didn't even know. Yeah. Okay, that, is I that all, people? <laughs> yeah. I sorry, sorry. Yes, that all. <laughs> sorry. No problem. <laughs> okay. People, thank you so much for making it so special. You are so wonderful. I don't have words to say goodbye. I just wish you the best. See you soon. See you soon. I could see you next year in intermediate four, or if not, maybe I could see you in advanced level. It's been such a pleasure meeting each one of you. And I wish each one of you the best of the best. And happy new year, happy 2023. Merry Christmas, enjoy your time with your family. This is it. Thank you for thank you. Hey, thank you. 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 you. Thank 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 you. Yes, God, yes. God bless you. God bless you, teacher. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. See you happy in 2023. All right. Yeah. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. Enjoy the Christmas bonus. Enjoy the Christmas bonus. Chaparro. <laughs> we will. We will. Good night, everybody. Don't drive. Don't drive. Don't drive. Be safe.